So I'm gonna go ahead and get the painful one out of the way. Yeah, you aren't as good as you think you are. I'm sorry to be the one to tell you, you just aren't. We lie to ourselves at an alarming rate and most of us will fall into what's called the Dunning-Kruger effect. All right, you can look this up. Basically, it's a curve where our confidence starts out at an all-time high because we don't have the perspective. And then once we hit some opposition, we quickly realize we are just not the level we think we are. That's okay. Now you might've searched this video because you're in that curve somewhere or because you're wondering what the bots are on about. All right, it's a painful reality, but perspective is huge. Now I swear this video isn't as painful moving forward. I just wanna go ahead and rip that bandaid off. I promise the video isn't as painful as that one. All right, so let's talk about slowing down. All right. Now I know you probably just downed a G Fuel and some Dino Nuggies, but trust me, slow the f down. All right, slow is smooth and smooth is fast. If you keep rushing into garbage situations, that's on you. Think about how many times Yo, you pinged a buy back. station last game for your teammates to buy you back. Yeah, that many, huh? So first, just slow down and use some of that brain juice to make a plan, which we will talk about what that looks like. All right, so speaking of slowing down and pacing, do not try to play at somebody else's pace unless you have played with them for a while. Just because Sweaty McNutts is dri diving through windows and 360 shock sticking five guys doesn't mean you have to, all right? Play at your own pace and you'll get there. Remember what I said, have a plan? Let's talk about what that looks like. Before you run into an engagement, take time to gather info. The best players just do this at an incredible speed, but they're still doing it. All right, stick to a mental outline. Now here's a basic one. Number one, how many ops are there? Number two, do they have great positioning? Does a specific enemy team member have a outrageously advantageous position? What? That was an incredibly long term for what I'm trying to say. Is there one of the guys that's up on a building, right? And there's two guys down low. Is, is there like an outlier that's going to be a bigger problem than the other ones? And number three, what position would give me the most advantage? Okay. From there, you need to get quick at determining the outcome of each engagement. All right. This is based on the equipment you have, like an AR and SMG and how comfortable you are. So if you're trying out a new weapon or you've been using it for a while, you need to factor that in. It also includes the equipment your op is using. Okay, are they running a sniper, prox mines? Are they using a handgun? Did they just drop in? Are they easy pickings? And what kind of initial damage was traded? Okay, so pro players are really good at this. Whenever they get shot, they make a decision mid fight. Am I gonna win this or not? If they're not, then they back off immediately. Then you start healing and repositioning. You wanna to play to your advantage. Are, are you a good sniper? Then snipe. Are you good with an AR? Then use an AR. Are you great up close? Then get in there with an SMG, all right? You need to play to your advantage. Make the enemy play your game, don't play theirs. This is outside of the game itself, but is your equipment, now whether it's console or PC, is it running optimally? Like, could you clean the vents on your console? Could you clean the vents on your PC? Do you have it stuck underneath a cabinet? Is it overheating, causing you to lag out? Are you on Wi-Fi or plugged directly into your router? So these things, settings in game, computer settings, all of these things will give you that advantage we talked about earlier. Also, engine owning has a good I'm just kidding. Now the next two are pretty obvious, but I'm gonna mention them anyway. Sleep, all right? Not just in video games, but in life, I'm telling you, and I learned this lesson probably at least three times a week, you yeah, need sleep. Minimum eight hours, some people can get by on seven, but you need sleep. Otherwise, your brain, your eyes, everything is not gonna react as fast as you need it to be. And mentioning equipment, as we did earlier, your human biological equipment, all right, is not running optimally, so you need that sleep. And last, the next up is practice, okay? Practice, practice, practice. Practice makes permanent, all right? Are you, are you missing shots? Okay, let's hop in that firing range in between rounds and shoot dummies, okay? See how high you can get your accuracy up. Maybe load up a shipment match and, and shoot box for, for maybe 30 minutes before you get on, all right? But practice, maybe in the pregame in Warzone, you, just, you shoot everybody you can, get as many, get, get as many kills as you can. All right, these are all things you need to, to do because practice is what's going to get you better. A lot of games are won by disciplined players who choose not to fight at certain times. All right, next up, you need to stay up to date on the best weapons and tactics. For those of you who don't know what meta stands for, the following ad is paid for by Mark Zuckerberg. It means most effective tactics available. The reality is if you want to excel, you need every advantage you can grab, like a Cronus. I'm just kidding. If you want to know about what the best weapons in Warzone, I do a loadout video every now and then. 
to keep up to date. As far as tactics go, I hope something in this video helped you and I'll continue to make ones like this to make sure, so make sure you're subscribed for that. Now it's your turn. Let's turn this comment section into a comprehensive guide for noobs on how to get better at shooters. Okay. Let me know what I missed or what you disagree with in the comments below. If you think generally I did a decent job, smash that like button. All right, that does it. We'll catch you in the next one. Let's go,